Hi, my name is Grace and I'm a dairy science major. I live in Somerset, Wisconsin, and I'm in this class because I love cows and I hope to learn a lot about cows, specifically calves. I'm going to be talking about Ayrshires, and there's not a lot known about the history of Ayrshires, um, but what I found is that they originated in the country of Ayr, which is located in Scotland. Um, there weren't records of Ayrshires until the 1720s when there was a record of them at shows. Um, they arrived to the U.S. in 1822, so they would be the second breed of dairy cattle to come to the U.S. right after the milking shorthorn. Um, some breed characteristics. Um, they're a really small cow. They're about 1,200 pounds full grown. Um, smaller than them would be Jerseys and a lot larger would be Holsteins. Um, over in Europe, they were really known for their hardiness and their vigor. Um, the calves were really aggressive and they did really well over there. Um, another reason that they did really well over in Europe was because they were known for their ability to digest grass. They were considered a grazer, um, so they could consume a lot of grass and make milk really quickly without costing the farmer a lot of money. Um, another cool fact is that um, their color, if you look at them, they look reddish, but the technical color is actually roan, not red. Um, some statistics. On average, a Ayrshire will produce nine gallons of milk per day. Um, they average a 3.9% butterfat and a 3.3% protein. And there's around 15,000 registered Ayrshires in the U.S. And then I got my info from Virginia Tech.